Hi guys, welcome to the channel. This is going to be a general reading for the collective, so let's find out together what's coming through for you. Energies for you, the Ace of Cups and the Six of Pentacles. Energies for your person, the King of Pentacles and the Two of Pentacles. Between you and your person, we have the Four of Wands. Meeting energies, the Fool, the Nine of Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles. The Oracle cards, Fork in the Road and TikTok. Guys, a lot of pentacles in this reading, so I want to say the material side of this connection can be a meaningful factor in the situation, but another important element is time, TikTok. Time is ticking. Seven of pentacles. I want to say something that may sound a little bit harsh to some of you, maybe. Uh, you have love for your person, you have high expectations in favor of the connection for once, your person is not really understanding your point of view, and they are holding back the connection, and by doing that, they can also hold you guys back. So there is a one man up, one man down dynamic at play, and you are on the losing side of the agreement. There is no equal give and take between the two of you, some of you are trying to push this connection forward towards the four of ones. Your person can be extremely driven, successful, well-built. If we think about the king of pentacles when it comes to finances and professional success. But if we think about the chance to take on more responsibilities in favor of a romantic connection, they can be iffy. It's like they can be two different people. That's why the connection is going to face a fork in the road. And the fork in the road will be one about the opportunity to move closer to the four of ones or pursue the nine of pentacles road. The leap of faith of the fool can be the big step that some of you in particular will have to take. Your person is playing with fire. I want to say that. And uh, the ace of cups is quite a gift, guys and your person is running the risk to miss a major opportunity with you. Let's pull more cards, let's see what we can get. High Priestess for the Ace of Cups, Three of Swords for the Six of Pentacles, Hanged Man for the King of Pentacles, Six of Wands for the Two of Pentacles, Ten of Wands for the Fool, Three of Cups for the Nine of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups, recurrent energy for the Seven of Pentacles. So love is put on hold. Why? Because your person wants to do so. But if that's the case, we can even say that the gift from the heart the Ace of Cups, that some of you are willing to share with this person may have an expiration date stamped on it, whether the two of you like it or not. The Three of Swords is increasing its relevance, guys, in a situation like this one. The connection has been super fun, super friendly, a true pleasure for quite some time, but your person is stuck hanged men, they are looking at the connection from a different point of view compared with yours. At some point, some of you can go quiet, high priestess, because it's like you can take a moment in order to take a good look at the situation and that moment will allow you guys to clearly see the one man up, one man down dynamic, six of pentacles influenced, that can bring to the table a major disappointment at the Three of Swords. Why? Because love, again, is kept stuck in a loop because your person is giving more importance to, let's say, the practical and material side of the connection, which may be important, yes, but it's not on the same level if we think about the importance that you can give to the emotional side of the connection. That's why a fun situation for some of you may not be enough anymore, 
And because you can get the perception that you are the only one that is actively working for the connection to move closer to the four of ones, at some point, you can realize that the last mile has already begun. And there is going to be the opportunity, at least, to drop the burdens in order to manifest the full energy in a different situation. So, guys, let's see. What should you focus on? The Wheel of Fortune. Time is of the essence. Time is ticking. But there is a chapter that can be left behind if your person doesn't realize that their stuckness is becoming a major issue for this connection. So the connection has the opportunity to begin a new stage that can be one about the four of ones progression, but your person is holding back from that step and this can become a deal breaker, guys. Two of Wands, soulful decision for me, major crossroads, there is the word involved in the card. And as I usually say, for me, the Two of Wands decision can set the tone for what comes next in the journey. Your offer is real. Your offer is on the table. Or I should say that your offer has been on the table for quite some time now. Your person kept looking at it without taking action in favor of it. At some point, some of you can stand up and leave. Look, eight of cups, oh my goodness. This is quite a confirmation, guys. It can be a thought, but the thought can become more and more real for some of you guys. Why? Because there is the moon in the background. You cannot understand why your person is so stuck. What's the obstacle? High Priestess, recurrent energy on your side, the silence. Kinda pretending that the Four of Wands is not a big deal, when in reality it is, especially for you. Staying quiet, guys, is not going to solve any problem. In a situation like this one, we have to speak up. Otherwise, it's like suffering in silence, you know? The Emperor. Taking action may not be a real option for your person right now because of the hanged man and the two of pentacles loop, you would love to move the connection forward, but it seems that your person kind of feels in charge of the situation. The emperor can be an energy about stubbornness sometimes, but stubbornness can ask for a price. The empress, much for the emperor. So the perfect couple on paper, that's why some of you have had high expectations in favor of the connection. And that's also why you cannot understand why your person is holding back. So this is about potential that can go down the drain because someone is too stuck, too entrenched in a mindset and they may not realize that time is running by and the connection somehow some way can fade away let's ask for guidance about this situation we didn't get energies about the opportunity to openly talk about the situation so far but it is necessary to do so. Here we go. Seven of Pentacles, recurrent energy. The connection can become stagnant, guys. Never the right time. Let's wait. 
let's do this other thing first and then this other one. Well, what about the four of ones? Nah, nah, not at the right time. We'll think about it later on. This can become a torture for some of you guys, three of swords. Look, ten of ones again. The last mile. It has already begun. The moon. We have seen the energy in the background of the Eight of Cups. This is about misunderstandings, guys. Things left unsaid. Your person doesn't want to go deep in the evaluation of the connection. They can give importance to, again, the material side of it and to the opportunity to share with you pleasant moments, yes, but they are holding back from the chance to allow the connection to develop. Five of Pentacles. Some of you can feel left out in the cold. If your person doesn't want to talk about the four of ones, it's like they are shutting the door right in your face. And for me, the five of pentacles, guys, can be an energy about the opportunity to talk with another person, but it's like we can speak different languages and so we cannot understand each other. That's why the moon is important. And we cannot find solutions to potential problems. If we cannot solve the problems together, we are kind of doomed if we think about a connection. The chariot. Guys, there is potential for the connection, but it takes two to tango, and it seems that your person is listening to a different music. And some of you may pretend that you can be patient for a little bit longer, and maybe you can do that, but at some point, the situation can become so overwhelming for you that you will have to express yourself about the fact that the connection is basically stuck. And if you do not receive from your person the feedbacks that can be in favor of the opportunity to move closer to the four of ones type of vision, you can make the difficult but necessary decision to move in a different direction, chariot eight of cups, because the fulfillment of your heart and soul cannot be properly manifested in this connection. So this would be a missed opportunity, 100%. And if that happens, it's because your person has made or is making the conscious decision to avoid an extremely important topic in the overall alchemy of the connection. So they want to win, basically. They do not want to talk about the four of ones, and they kind of expect from you guys a passive approach because you should settle for the connection as it is. I do not think that this is possible. And so time is ticking, time is of the essence. There is a major crossroads ahead, guys. And I think that some of you can be called to make a courageous decision. And then even if there can be the opportunity to move in a different direction. Some of you can be willing and ready to go from there. And your person will have to live with that, guys. So I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful somehow, some way. If you want to comment, like, and subscribe, it will help our channel to grow. So thank you. And until next time, I wish you all the best. Take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon. Bye.